And that's why you don't hang your clothes from clothespins by the shoulders when you're drying them. Look at this. Look at this. I got, like, pointy shoulders now. <laughs> um, yeah, I... I washed my clothes and then I dried them by hanging them by clothespins. Some of them because I can't I can't put some of them in the dryer or else they'll shrink. So I learned the hard way. You don't uh, you don't do clothespins by the shoulders. Uh, man, this is weird. This is very strange, guys. I'm using my iPhone to do this video and it is pointing at me. I am looking right at myself. This is weird. But I got to say, it's kind of nice. It's kind of nice not having to worry about driving. I got water. I can drink water if I want. Watch this. Mm. Just drink water. Um, phone's at 20%. So we got to make this quick. <laughs> got to make this quick. Okay. So guys, um, first things first. Let's talk about the channel really quick. A couple people have said, hey, you know, you haven't uploaded a video in a few days. This was like yesterday. What's going on? So I missed a couple days for videos, and I'm mainly just putting up fly boys right now. There's a few things going on. Um, I had the the primal or the hunter primal, the, the primer hunter. I had the hunter primal with Corrales, and we're loving loving that series. But Corrales went on vacation for three weeks, so that series is kind of out of commission for a little while. Um, also, I've been spending a lot of time getting ready for my Twitch subscriber server, and that's almost done, and I'm going to talk about that in just a minute. One of the questions, we'll talk about it in a few minutes, uh, but yeah, I've been working on the subscriber server, and I'm trying to figure out what I want to do, um, what direction I want to go with the channel. I definitely want to continue Flyboys. I definitely want to continue playing Minecraft, but I do want to do a few things differently with my channel that I'm really excited about, and I think you guys will be too. And I don't want to say too much right now, um, and actually this relates to a question that's that I'll address later as well. So anyway, um, yeah, so that's kind of why there have there have been a few less videos Eventually, once I get everything kicked in gear, it's going to be more videos. It'll be great. Um, yeah, so be very excited. Um, what else is going on? Yeah, we're, we're indoors. Roads aren't too bad today, but they're not great. So I'm like, let's just let's hang out inside. It's great. So first question uh, from you, Verona, says, when are we going to hear you sing? Okay, so last stream... We were talking about, I don't know why, I don't know how this came up, we were talking about <laughs> singing, and um, I was talking with Cube. Cube is a great singer, and we were talking about singing, and my <laughs> my response to anyone who wants to hear me sing is, check out uh, Comeback Wolfie, check out that movie, or that video, it's a movie, <laughs> check out that video, and you will hear me sing. And if I'm going to sing in public, I want control. If, I, if the public is going to hear me, I'd like to have control. So with Comeback Wolfie, I can record it as many times I, as I want, do a little pitch perfection, make it sound nice. If I just flat out sing, ah, it's not great. I'm not a professional singer. And I don't know, man. Maybe, maybe I'll start singing more. Who knows? I'll do a little stuff. Check out We Kill Thai Designs. That's almost like a song. <laughs> um, by the way, Ellie, if you are watching this, dude, that was so good. Okay. If you don't know what I'm talking about, check out Ellie Beatmaker's We Kill Thai Designs song. Next question was from Trinity. Talk about the sub server. So here we go. We're talking about the Twitch subscriber server. So if you guys don't know, um, I have a subscriber server that we've been working on for a very long time um, with Full Effect Hosting. The server is going to launch, I think we're going to be ready to go Saturday. And um, I, can't, I can't recommend Full Effect enough. Um, and actually, I think I'm going to have a coupon code if you ever want to like, have your own server. So I'll get that going. Um, maybe I'll put that in the description 
on my Twitch page once we get the server going up, but keep your eyes peeled for that. But bottom line, server is ready to go. Um, I just need to do a few more things, so I think we're just going to launch for Saturday. But I want to do a little sneak peek tomorrow at the stream, Wednesday. I want to do a little sneak peek, show you guys the server so you can see it. Um, people can't hop on yet, but um, but I'll be able to show you you know a few things. So you get a little sneak peek, and then Saturday, it's like, it's on. So the Twitch subscribers will be able to to hop on. So I'm really excited to show you guys the server. So sneak peek Wednesday, full opening Saturday. Um, next question was, let me see. I got the page open. Why don't I just look? I don't even need to memorize this. Um, Kieran says, what new games are you interested in and will you start them on the channel? Okay. This goes along with the plan for the channel. Um, my channel has mainly been based around Minecraft, and I'm still going to be doing plenty of Minecraft, but I do want to try out some other games, and um, I can't say any specific games right now, but you'll be seeing them soon, and I'm really excited, because there there are a lot of great games that I've just never, um, never really gotten into, but I think it'll just be fun to, to try out some new ones and share it with you guys, so I'm very, very excited. Next question, Tough Guy 42 I remembered you. Um, yeah, I saw that name. I was like, oh, I remember that. You donated, you donated to me on uh, during my live stream, so thank you for that. But he said, uh, how do I convince my mom that me being on the computer isn't a bad thing? Like, I play football and go to the gym. What should I do? Okay. Usually when people ask me for like advice, like real life advice, I always start out saying I don't know all the details to your situation, but from what I hear, it sounds like um, sounds like you spend a decent amount of time on the computer, but you're not always on the computer. You're doing other recreational things. I think that's great. Like, I don't think it's great uh, to be on the computer all day, every day, have no social interaction, do no exercise. Like, it's good to have balance in your life, do other things. Sounds like you have that, but I don't know how, how long you're on the computer. Um, I, feel like, I feel like as time goes on, um, time spent on the computer is going to be a little more accepting by parents. I feel like when TV was new, um, like I wasn't alive at this point, but I'd assume, and I feel like parents... You know, even parents to this day, a lot of parents don't want their kids watching a lot of TV. But um, a lot of parents are like, yeah, you know, I don't care if someone's wa if their kid's watching TV for a little while. Um, but some some parents think that too much time on the computer is a bad thing. What you could possibly do is um, maybe maybe you could compromise. Like, I think, I think compromising is a great solution for a lot of uh, disagreements in life. I don't know, I don't, like I said, I don't know what the whole situation is, but maybe you can talk to your mom and just say, hey, what if we just set a certain amount of time um, per day that I'm on the computer that you don't think is excessive, and we just, you know, do that. So that's one thing you could do. Um, or you could say, you could talk about the productive things you're doing on the computer because there's a lot of productive things you do on the computer. The more time you spend on a computer, the more skills you develop. And I think as time goes on, um, computer skills are going to be really valuable in the workforce. I think there's going to be more, um, more jobs involving the computer as time goes on. I don't, I don't know, I'm not from the future, but I think that's how things are going to go. So, knowing how to work, uh, knowing your way around a computer, knowing um, how, how things work, knowing, just, just the more you know, the better. So, you could, you could kind of talk about that kind of stuff, how, how it's beneficial to your life. Um, I'm rooting for you, man, but... Um, you know, it sounds like it sounds like you are pretty balanced, though, because you know you're probably in school, you're playing football, you go to the gym. These are all really good things. Um, but I will agree that too much time on the computer might not be a great thing. 
I'm rooting for you. Hopefully, maybe a little compromise will help the situation. Um, now, Platanasos, last question. Are you... Wait a minute. I think this is... Yeah. Yeah, this is the last question. Um, he said, are you planning what you will do for work when you are 50 plus? This is a great question because what I'm doing right now, uh, I don't know a lot of people in their 50s doing this. So, okay, before I was doing this, I had another job in the healthcare field. And when I left, they said the door is always open if I want to come back. Thing is, to keep my certification, I have to get a bunch of credits before 2017. I'm currently not earning them because I'm hoping I don't have to go back and um, it would be a huge effort for me to be gaining these, these credits. I'd be having to go to conventions relating to my old job and that's not like the best use of my time right now. If, if I did have to go back, like I could make it happen like, there's some online courses I could do and just a lot of stuff. I could make it happen. So I do have a fallback plan. Um, I might end up just trying to keep that certification over time. Um, also, there are... Uh, I do have some other options. Like, uh, my dad owns a company. Uh, also, like, I've always been interested in design. This is kind of a long shot, but... In my time on YouTube, I've I've done most of my own artwork for the channel. So I consider that like four years of design experience. So, you know, I could go back to school, you know, for design, kind of pursue that. That's kind of a long shot, but I have I do have some some options for uh life after YouTube. But but this that's a great question and it, it definitely hits home. It's definitely something that that I think about and um, it's important. But guys, that is going to do it for this week. Um, sorry the video is a little late tonight. Um, just very busy. <laughs> but I'm trying to get this uh, trying to get this subscriber server done uh, as quick as possible. And make it uh, try to make it as great as, as great of an experience as possible for you guys. So if you missed yesterday's Fly Boys, I would recommend checking it out. It was with John and Generic B. Absolutely hilarious. And hope to see you at the stream tomorrow. All right. You guys have a great day. See ya.